probably the the tack is gonna be close. What's up YouTube? Today is November 5th, 2023. Current time is 7.47 a.m. And I am at Sherman Island today. Sherman Island, Sacramento River. Um, I actually didn't know where to go to today for my video because it's kind of last minute planning. But um, one of you guys commented on one of my videos saying, you guys caught a big one here? Yeah, I mean, a lot of people here, it's a Sunday, so I don't, I don't know. When I first got here too, the fish are bowling up like crazy, and um, I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna catch something today, guys. May not be big, but I think I'm gonna catch something. <laughs> but um, yeah, guys, I'm gonna be just al al alternating between like lures and uh, I guess I'm gonna for sure have at least one pull out, and then I'm gonna take one one another bait pull out and just try lures, and then just you now alternate between that. But um. Yeah, let's get it, boys. Stay tuned, relax, and enjoy the video. Let's go. Oh. That was cool. So heavy. I got a little one, bluegill maybe, or nothing. Oh, what the? Oh, I'm not sucker. <laughs> Guess I'm throwing him on my big pole, right? I think I'm good. All right, well, I guess we're gonna try this, guys. Um, a mud sucker and like anchovy. It's, it's a lot of work to take it off, so I'm just gonna do it on. All right, see you later, dude. Catch me a big one. And whatever is eating it, it's pulling. Might have another one. Nope, not that. Get back out there. Time to switch it up. We're gonna go lighter now, guys. If the big fish aren't biting, gotta go lighter. Got to. I knew it, man. I downsized my uh, my pole. I'll get one. <sighs> I know it's not a keeper, but we'll measure him. Let's go, boys. 
Got this fish at 931. <clears throat> so guys, it was probably the, the tackle, you know, the tackle was too heavy. Switched to my lighter pole. He is uh, just about 13 inches. Ooh, all right. Oh yeah, boys. <laughs> Man, I knew if I switched the tackle to like lighter, I would, I would catch one. All right, dude. Thanks for the fight. See you later. Tax difference. Man, it makes a difference, guys. Gotta use lighter. At least bring like one lighter pole. A, a lot of people I see they, they use like like uh like two big poles. I'd say at least bring like a medium action rod, spinning or bait caster, doesn't really matter. But um yeah boy stay tuned. You know I'm gonna throw a night crawler on there. See if that will help. Yeah, I'm still getting bites on the ultralight guys. I just can't hook them. Like really small fish. It's like I don't really have faith in, in my ultralight guys because I'm getting so many bites and it's just I don't know. I just can't get anything. No way. Oh, I'm snagged. Damn. That's why. Snap off. Ah. I guess we'll check this bait real quick. It's like I, I pick up this one and then the other one wants to go off. Oh wow, that's a good bite. Got this little mud sucker at 10.06. Oh, he's bleeding. Alright. Close up. <laughs> so we'll just leave my ultralight out now. I don't use... Some people think I use three poles. I don't use three poles. When I do catch like my bait fish, I normally stick it on my bigger pole and then I, I take out my smaller pole. So that's why I don't need you guys. So yeah, I, I stick by the laws, guys. Make sure you guys use two poles. You guys got the two pole tag. Still getting bites on the other one too. All right, now we wait, guys. Oh yeah. I don't think this is a keeper. <laughs> Almost fell in the hole. Our boys got this fish at 1016. Might be a keeper. It's gonna be close. Oh look at 16, 17 inch. Yeah, he is 16 and a half inches. Nice. Alright dude. Thanks for the fight. See you later.
Alright okay, guys, caught this fish at 10.47. Alright buddy, thanks for the fight, see you later. Alright guys, here is the recap of the day. Current time is 12.54 p.m. And today I fished Sherman Island, Sacramento River area. Uh, yeah guys, uh, I, I caught like two, two stripers and like two mud suckers. Uh, it wasn't a bad day. I caught my biggest striper. I haven't caught a striper over 16 inches in a while, which is cool. Actually, was it 13 inches? I don't, I don't remember, but um, caught a decent sized striper. Give me a decent fight. I don't know if the the full striper are coming in or what, but um, hopefully the striper fishing starts picking up, y'all. You know, I don't know when this fall run is gonna start happening or if it is, it already started, but um, I don't know. I'm gonna try some new spots soon, though, you guys. Just stay tuned for the new striper videos coming up, but um yeah if you guys uh, enjoyed the video or learned something new please like comment and subscribe i'm out peace